Now we all know The Boys is a show that depicts how superheroes would look like if they actually existed in real life. It's a really great show and if you really ever consider watching it just make sure that you're 18 and above. But anyway moving on, the show has 4 seasons and I have only watched 2, the first 2. So should I really be one talking about this? <laughs> what do I care? The show really shows what it's like for the superheroes to be on camera and in front of an audience and what they are like off camera and in their own personal lives. They're actually shitty people. So there's this multi-billion dollar company that creates the soups, giving people power, making them popular, making them rich and famous, marketing them to the entire world. You know what? I'm beating around the bush. Let me just get to it. I'm guessing most of y'all already know what the boys is. Like I said, great show, gory, portrays how superheroes are gonna be like if they actually existed. Some might be chill, some might be disgusting, some proud, and some just embody everything. And to top it all off, that nigga's psychotic! Yeah, I'm talking about you, Homelander. Look at this dude, he really has an American flag for a cape. Bro literally uses his power to oppress people. Like, if you mess with him one time, he gonna laser your freaking head off. Cut you in half even. This rip-off bootleg Superman. A-Train, bootleg Flash, Queen Maeve, bootleg Wonder Woman, The Deep, and this sorry ass nigga, bootleg Aquaman. And the heroes also have flaws. I don't know the flaws for some of them, but I'm just gonna talk about the ones I know. A-Train, the bootleg Flash. Bro is so obsessed with speed and becoming even faster. Hell, you're not even bootleg Flash, you're bootleg Zoom. Just like Zoom kept injecting himself with that Velocity 9 to make himself faster. This is the CW Flash, by the way. A-Train be overdosing on the substance that makes the suits have powers to make himself even faster. Compound V. Then he gave himself heart problems. Homelander, that guy's just a freaking maniac, man. With his constant need to be loved. And then he also has this obsession with breast milk. Ugh, I think I'm gonna throw up. That does not sit well with me at all. Big bad Homelander, obsessed with boob milk. Bro, he's just a big fat babe. And no one can stand up to him. He's like the big bad wolf, the big bad guy literally the strongest and most powerful you mess with him off with your head she if you want an early retirement from life i dare you bitch slap homeland i really feel sorry for the deep like i pity for this guy bro has gills can talk to fish is useless outside water he really is not needed had this thing with women in the first season now everyone hates this guy no one likes him and it is just sad i mean he's been trying to make amends i don't know how it turns out in the future but deep no one likes the deep man Jeez. No, sometimes when he's talking to his fellow seven teammates or just anybody, I feel sorry for him. I want to cry for this guy. Like when Butcher and Mates were trying to get this terrorist guy to some island, they was riding on a boat and then Deep shows up, parks a whale in front of him and was like, yeah, I did that. I did something. But he saw the boys weren't stopping. Bro did not know what to do. Look at this stance he takes next. My guy was just confused. Looking like he about to take a dump. Being a human in this universe gotta be straight ass. You better respect yourself. Do your own thing, mind your business, before you piss someone off and you lose a limb. Or someone holds you in your face like this and then your head is gone. Who knows how many countries in the world have received compound V. Normal civilians are not safe. Don't even get me started with the boys. Because one way or the other, they lives have been messed up by Vault or one of them superheroes. And now they want to stick it to them. So anytime they on a mission of some sort, I be praying to God that they stay alive. Because they have no power. And bullets don't work on these suits. You know God is the one protecting them in this world. Especially my man Yui. Homelander hates this guy. He has come this close to just dying by the hands of Homelander. And when the soups kill, they kill with no remorse. Once they kill you, you dead. They take it to the press, on TV, on the news, and they act like nothing happened. It's just a normal day in the office. God damn, the boys Butcher, Kimiko, Marvin, Mother's Milk, MM, or Frenchie, and Huey. I don't know it's just a show and they have plot armor protecting them, but still, they be doing all sorts of dangerous missions. When there's no soup, I pray a soup doesn't show up. When there's a soup, I pray the soup don't catch them. Because if a soup catch them, then they in soup. It spells major trouble for their asses. Stormfront. Oh my god. 
I hate Stormfront. Why is she even a part of the team? Why is she a part of the show? She's always gaslighting and causing issues. Anytime they show her face up on the screen, I just roll my eyes and turn my head 360 and go, oh my god, why is she even here? With her Nazi ass. Yo, check out how they jump her though. Let's get it. Girls, we get it done. Fight back, nigga. Fight back. And she races too. Beat the racism out of her ass. I just hate Stormfront, man. I like Homelander, but sometimes he just goes overboard. And at that point, I just want someone to kill him. But you know, that's highly impossible. They'll get him someday. And as much as I've clowned on these characters throughout this entire video, this show is actually pretty nice. Just go watch something else. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and smash a like. And I'll see you in the next one. Like the jumping wasn't enough, she threatened Baby Lander's mother and bro was just boiling. Bro was like, I ain't gonna let that shit slide, Holmes. Then he fries her ass up, turned her ass into steak, cut off her arm, cut off her legs, and then she commits suicide in season three. <laughs> I'm just having way too much fun with these characters downfall. I'm gonna see y'all later.